only deal with fire, we passing on all the weak ish. Talking pure culture, ain't none of that hype beast ish. Nah, this beginning to the end, no. Always keep it G, ain't nothing here for pretend, yo. Yeah, so you should want to lift your friends, know the God of the sneakers get blessed by Saint Hendo. Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Saint Hendo, God's favorite sneakerhead. Alright, so. I robbed though. Alright. <laughs> so I robbed though. Alright, I went to go. I decided that I wanted to order. Um, I wanted I wanted a pair of sneakers that I knew I was gonna wear. But also, um, I wanted them to be dirty. I wanted them to be filthy. So like I, I just I wanted something I could try out, this new little concoction I made of my own cleaner. So um I found a pair of 350s on here. Alright. So a pair of 350. Yeezy Zebras, and these these joints are dirty. You know what I'm saying? Like they they need some attention. You know what I'm saying? And I got these for about a hundred bucks. All right? So you can't beat that. All right? So they just need some attention. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna uh, try my new cleaner out on here, and pretty much that's what this whole video was about. So um, see like grass stains on it and everything, like all kinds of shit. So, out so, and then I'll re ice them when I get my ice box back. Right. So, uh, what I'm going to do in this video is I am going to clean these and kind of put the work in on them and see if I can get them back to white, white. And then we'll kind of, you know, get them together and see how see how this new concoction I made goes. Because usually I use, uh, what do I use? I use Crips and I also use. Um, what you call rejuvenator. Rejuvenator is what I use like almost all the time. So predominantly what I'm going to do is the same system as rejuvenator, but I'm not I'm not going to use their products. I'm going to use my own stuff that I made up, which is just um, some light detergent, some light liquid detergent mixed with some essential oils and stuff like that. Like that's really all it is. Um, so that's what I'll be putting work in on these with. That's what this video is about. So um, I'll do some cleaning. Um, I'm not going to actually commentate through the whole thing i'll kind of speed through the cleaning and all that um but uh at certain parts i'll probably i'll have uh i'll tell you exactly what's going on when i put them like in a washer and all that kind of stuff so that's it so stay tuned uh i hope you guys uh, enjoy we're gonna get through this all right so hopefully we we didn't just waste a, a hot hundred and some change all right so we'll see if we can get these back to white because you know these ain't supposed to look like this these look dingy and horrible, you know what I'm saying? So we'll see what we can do with it. So I'll readjust this camera, start getting uh, everything set up, and uh, I'll be right back with y'all. All right. All right, next thing you want to do is put it in the washing machine. So I do cold wash, which I recommend you do. It doesn't help, you know, it really helps get the stains out when it's cold. It really puts the work in. All right, so cold, I do extra heavy on the soil and I do max extract for the speed. Uh, so that should be all you really need. Uh, and then just 
pretty much press start. There you go. So let's see how it go. All right. So when you put it in the washer, uh, remember to keep the uh, the shoe trees in there, like the, the hard plastic shoe trees. Those got to be in there to make sure the sneaker keeps its form. Um, take out the laces, take out the insoles, place the insoles and the laces inside of the laundry bag and tie that up and then throw everything into the washer. Um, so that way everything can get washed independently. So nothing is kind of inhibiting like the, the water and everything getting to where it needs to go. All right. So uh, that was it. That should be everything. All right. Yeah. All right. We'll be back. All right. All done. Everything is finished. Uh, came out real good. Uh, I can't be more happy or pleased with this little steel I came up on. So, I'll show y'all what it looked like. All right. it, was, it was impressive, you know what I'm saying? It was pretty dingy in the get go, you know what I'm saying? A little something. Cool. But yeah, they cleaned up pretty all right. You know what I'm saying? Pretty all right. So, once I get my, um, my ice box back, I'm gonna ice these. So we'll have them pretty much back to the factory. I put new laces in and did some custom lacing on there. All right, so here, let me check you out. All right, so nothing crazy, but they came out pretty damn good. That solution that I made, I'm, I'm literally probably just going to use that from here on out. I don't see any reason why I should grab anything else um, at this point because these came out pretty much perfect. Um, so I don't have any complaints um, for this price that I paid <laughs> you can't beat it for the price that I paid and just need a little cleanup um, it don't get any better than that all right so uh, that was it I definitely appreciate you guys stopping by same old same old grinding as usual so I definitely appreciate you guys checking out everything um, new subscribers I'm keeping the content going uh, thank you I definitely appreciate anybody that joined the uh, sneaker page on Facebook like amazing thank you guys um, so we'll keep it pumping man keep it pumping but this was like this was like a little couple day project y'all don't even realize um, but you know I got a life outside of YouTube I got you know stuff I got to do so I didn't really have time to kind of shoot everything at once um, so everything is everything I appreciate y'all all right, I'll let you.